How's it going, number one? Welcome back. And today we're going to talk about how to solve the loading problems on Safari browser. So let's just say you were just trying to go to a website, but you see this and it maybe keeps going, but you, it never gets open. So if you ever encounter the loading problems on your Safari browser, then here is how I can troubleshoot that. So let's go. The first things, of course, is pretty obvious, which is the connection. So if your internet is down or not working properly, you might face the same problem. So what you can do, you can try to open up your other browsers or other apps like YouTube or Facebook just to see if everything goes fine or not. If you see, well, you have loading problems to other applications, then I will highly recommend you to enable airplane mode for a quick restart for the network, turn it off or switch your network. Let's say you're using a Wi-Fi, then turn it off from here and turn on your mobile data. You know, turn up your mobile data and turn on your Wi-Fi to see if that works or not. So let's say you've done the basic things, but still it's not helpful. It's you still have loading problems with the browser. Then here's the thing that you guys really have to do. So you gotta head over to the settings. Um, you just gotta go to the general here. Uh, find out iPhone storage and find out Safari browser, select that and tap website data. If you found any website data from your browser, make sure to remove that from here. Simply tap remove all, it will be removed. After that, you want to go back here and scroll down to the bottom, find out, open up apps here and let me type Safari here as well and scroll down here and tap uh, this clear history on the website data and make sure to select all history and all profile and enable the close all tab tap clear history and quickly after that just simply go ahead and restart your iphone now mostly this is going to help you to solve your problems but still if you have problems there are two things you guys really really want to do on your iphone to make sure everything is you know work as you might expect so next things we're going to take a look at is uh the settings just go to the settings here and this time we are going to go to some advanced settings as well. So let's go to the uh, screen time, scroll down, tap content and privacy restrictions and turn this on. Let's open up the app store, media and website and games and select web content. Make sure to select re unrestricted. If you're choosing only a free website or a limited website, it will just keep load, like it will keep loading, especially when you just try to access to a different website from your iPhone. Make sure to select unrestricted. Uh, get back here. Uh, let's go to the main settings here. Go to general, scroll down to date and time. So make sure your date and time is accurate, set automatically. And last thing that you guys can do, you can go to the uh, transform reset iPhone, select reset and simply select reset all settings. Now what, what this will do, it will not only remove the box or glitches, um, solve the network problem as well. Just do it on your iPhone and after that your problem is going to be solved. And if you still have a problem on your iPhone, please do let me know in the comment section. I'll help you further right in the comment section. See you guys around.